every farmer must know that it is important to make you, your feed very tasty, very likable, and very loved by your animal so that the animal can consume it, enjoying the consumption and minimize wastages due to lack of palatability. Molar Plus Livestock Microbes is a sure bet when you want to make dry maize stovers palatable. How do you make silage from hay that is dry? How do you make silage from post-harvest crop residues? The first thing you do is you meal your dry maize stovers or your hay or your troughs of all nature. After milling them, dip them in raw water to reconstitute the moisture content. The dipping must not necessarily take long. A minute to three is enough to expose your dry maize stovers or wheat troughs or barley troughs that you have milled to good quality moisture. After you have milled and dipped in raw water, put that stuff on a dry surface. Then take a, a, a liter of molar plus livestock microbes, two liters of molasses, and 20 liters of raw water. Sprinkle into that mixture generously as you mix. A pump of 20 liters that has only one liter of molar plus livestock microbes and two liters of molasses can be mixed comfortably in one ton of such feed. After you have done that, for such dry maize stovers or grasses that have been dried like hay and wheat straws and barley straws and all nature of straws including rice straws, you can always put a bag of 50 kilos to 200 kilos of wheat bran or maize bran in that mixture as you sprinkle a liter of molar plus livestock microbes in 20 liters of raw water and you mix thoroughly and then ensile that stuff in a drum or at a, in a silage pit or in a bunker or in a silage bag and before you realize within 24 hours you have good quality silage but we recommend that you start using that silage after three days the time it will take to mature will heavily depend on how much maize bran or wheat bran you put into that mixture of dry maize stovers or wheat straws or barley straws or hay. We actually deliver and you will realize that that silage will give you increased milk production, increased growth production, increased meat production, increased fertility, increased health and reduced cow dung. And you will love what you see.